The new Dell UltraSharp U3223QZ monitor is here. The new IPS black screen of Dell's 4 Kelvin UltraSharp 32U3223QZ video conferencing monitor creates a strong first impression. Even while it might not evoke LED's level of contrast, the screen's stronger blacks and brighter than normal display give it a far higher contrast level than IPS which helps colors pop and enhances viewability. Add to that a tilting 4 Kelvin webcam, 12W speakers, mic array, touch controls for video conferencing on the bezel, daisy chaining power delivery and monitors, a ton of USB ports for docking, and more. It sounds like a tempting package with all those features. So, hello and welcome to Simplify Tech. I hope you are having great day so far. In today's video, we will tell you about the new Dell UltraSharp U3223QZ in detail with all its feature and specification. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. If only because the included USB-C cable is too short to be used with many desktop computers, This monitor is suited for owners of laptops that were produced within the last few years. The only cable I tried that recognized the webcam as 4 Kelvin was the one that was included. I've seen problems with a Dell webcam failing to recognize a USB 3.2 connection on a desktop computer, which is required for the 4 Kelvin resolution before. Without that recognition, it returns to 1080p at 30 or 60 frames per second. I gave up and just tested the video conferencing functions on a laptop. Dimensions 31.5 in, diagonally 80 centimeters. The panel is IPS black with an LED backlight, both flat or curled, 3840 x 2160 resolution and 140 pixels per inch, 16 to 9 aspect ratio. The DCI maximum P3's range is 98%. 400 nits of high brightness, 400 HDR HDR display, none of the above, maximum vertical refresh rate of 60 Hz, 3 panel warranty, 1 bright pixel panel exchange, replacement ship the next business day. Most customer reviews have been favorable, praising it for its functionality and presentation. A protective case, according to several reviewers, would improve the monitor. So, that's all for this video. I really hope this video was helpful for you. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe this channel.